enough Jesus for there is no other name my Lord and my God Father we just worship you this morning we bless your name this morning my Lord and my God and we thank you Lord for everything that you have done for us and what you are going to do for us this morning Father we just praise you and we worship you this morning touch our musicians this morning my Lord and my God even in Jesus as I stand before you that what I speak will be from your word from the sweet and blessed Holy Spirit and not my thoughts or what I feel. No, it's not about feeling, but it's about speaking the unadulterated word of the living God this morning. Touch our speaker this morning, my Lord and my God. That when she stands here this morning, Father, that when, whatever she says, Lord Jesus, it will be, it will be from the word and we will take it, Lord Jesus, of our hearts and our lives and our lives will be changed and we will not leave here the same. So Father, we just praise you this morning. We love you. We thank you, Lord. Touch each and every one of the youths represented here this morning and even those on their way, Lord Jesus. We bless you and we praise you and we're about to worship you, Father. We praise the name of the living God this morning. Can we give the Lord a round of applause this morning? Praise the Lord. Praise the name of the living God this morning. As the worship team comes this morning, let's welcome them. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's give God a high note of praise this morning. Because He is worthy to be lifted high. He is worthy to be thanked and praised and worshipped and adored. Hallelujah. We bless the name this morning, Jesus. We are here to worship the King of Kings. And the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah, Father, we bless the name of Jesus. Father, we worship you, O God. You are Lord of Holy Lord. You are Lord of Lord. You are one of the ones, you Lord. Father, we praise your name this morning, Jesus. Oh, we worship you, O Lord. Thank you for your presence, O God. Thank you for your Holy Spirit, O God. Thank you, Lord. We glorify your name this morning, Jesus. You are Lord and holy. You are Lord and Lord. You are Lord and worthy, great and mighty God. We bless you this morning, O God. We thank you for the privilege we have, Lord, to worship your holy name, Lord Jesus. We glorify your name, O Lord. Hallelujah to the Lamb that was staying on Calvary's tree. Father, we bless your name this morning, Jesus. We thank you for the cross of Calvary. We thank you for your blood of God. We thank you for your Holy Spirit of God. We thank you for life of God. We thank you for help of God. We thank you for strength of God. We just magnify your name this morning, Jesus. You are holy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are awesome, God. We magnify your name this morning, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. We bless your name, O God. Hallelujah, Lord. We bless your holy name, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless your name this morning, O God. You are God alone and there is none else, Father God. We bless your name this morning, Jesus. Hallelujah. Worthy are you, Lord, to be thanked and praised and worshipped and adored. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. God of vengeance has won my battle for me. God of miracles has won my battle for me. God of
the old method now. Hopefully, that the old method. Hallelujah, it might be a new song to some of us, but it's a powerful song. Hallelujah, we are thankful to God for the things that He has done for us. Hallelujah, see, when we fight, we fight from a place of victory. He has already done it for us. Hallelujah. So he's our God of vengeance and he's our God of miracles. Hallelujah. Sing. The God of vengeance has won my battle for me. And all the God of miracles has won my battle for me. My God of vengeance has won my
just for me because I'm telling you, he deserves it. He deserves our worship, he deserves our praise, he deserves our time, he deserves everything. Hallelujah, Father. Let's, let's clap up to the Lord this morning. Hallelujah. He's an awesome and a mighty God. Hallelujah. Father, we bless your name this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah, we bless your name. Now the word of God says, for the spirit of heaviness, put on the garment of praise. Hallelujah, and then we go through some stuff sometimes. And not only that, in the world right now, things are so terrible. There's so much that is happening. Fulfillment of biblical prophecies. So much things are happening and we really have to praise the Lord. You know, sometimes that's a go through the day. We have to praise him. We have to worship him. We have to magnify his name. He will give us the strength that we need to fight and to win whatever battle, whatever we are going through. There's only God that can help us to do that. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This is how I fight my battles. I praise you, Lord. This is how I fight my battles. I just worship in you. This is how I fight my battles. My lips to the holy hand. This is how I fight my battles. This is how I fight. This is how I fight my battles. This is how I fight my battles. This is how I fight my This is how I fight my battle. This is how I fight my battle. 
you are away from church and from reading your word and from serving the God, 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 He will do it. The more you can make you that person that doesn't resemble God, He will do it. Because you will give Him the right to do it. We give Him the right to do it. You understand? So we have to be so careful. We have to be so careful of the enemy because He is standing right there by our side. You think he's leaving? God there too? God and angels near the fence. But he is there. He goes up to God. He goes up and asks. You think he's making a joke? We're making a joke. But he's not making any joke. He's not making a joke at all. He wants you. He wants your soul. He wants your time. He wants everything. He will take everything from you. If you don't put yourself in a place where you have where you make God your your one and only he is there and he did not choke him with us it is time for we believers we I'm talking about ourselves too that we really really lift up the name of Jesus and serve him in spirit and in truth read his word learn of him Thank him for the things that he the fact that we are alive, we are little as well. He has been really and truly good to us. He's an awesome God, he's a mighty God. And he has already forgiven us of all of our sins and unrighteousness. That's how he is. So let's give God a clap off for him this morning. Let's clap off to the Lord. Hallelujah. And we bless your name this morning. We bless your name this morning. We magnify your name, God. Hallelujah. We glorify your name, Jesus. Praise the name of the living God. Church, we have your seats this morning. As the psalmist says, Bless the Lord of my soul and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. And that is why we are here this morning to worship the Lord, not to be entertained by the worship team. Awesome music this morning. Thank you very much. But to worship the Lord this morning. But what did David say? David, dance unto the Lord. Everything, every time David got an opportunity, he praised the Lord. And let me just remind the church this morning, some of those songs that we sang, you know, we tend to sing songs, but we also have to listen to the words of the songs because what the Lord Jesus did on that cross for us, those whips, when that flagrum struck his back, and chunks of flesh came out and blood flowed down Calvary's cross. That was for you and that was, that was for me and that was for you. And hence the reason we are here this morning. And we can say with all authority that we serve the creator of heaven and earth. And we are in the palm of the hand of the living God this morning. Praise the Lord. And also remember that we are strongest when we are on our knees. The battle is real. But we who know our God will do great exploits. Bless the Lord. Thank you, worship you this morning. Praise the Lord. Not for the you and just get ready for the Lord's supper this morning. I got my mom. I ask Sister Sandra and uh, Sister Marie to assist with the serving. Please this morning. Praise the Lord. For all those who And take or partake, we welcome you this morning as well. Sister Sandra, Sister Marie, can you get ready to serve the congregation, please? Thank you. Praise the name of the living God this morning. Church, it is good, great to be in the house of the Lord this morning. Amen. Amen. Wait, I didn't hear anything about that. Amen. Amen. I'm going to be like Pastor Michelle. It's great to be in the house of the Lord this morning. Amen. I am thankful. Praise the name of the living God. So let's just allow ourselves and for many of us here we know the seriousness of what we're about to do. This is not this is not just a a shot of non-alcoholic wine and a slice of bread. This is serious business and we cannot, let me reiterate, we cannot take it unworthily. This also is a commemoration of what the Lord's future reign is going to be like church. Make no mistake about it. Every time I stand on this platform, I remind the church that our 
our ultimate goal is to hear, well done, good and faithful servant. You do not want to close your eyes and hear, depart from me. Because you will be in a place of eternal hell and away from the, the Lord God Almighty. And we bow our heads and close our eyes as I bless the sacrifice this morning. Heavenly Father, my Lord and my God. Lord, we're about to partake of Holy Communion. You said in your word in Matthew that as often as we do it, we do it in remembrance of you. And that is what we're about to do this morning, my Lord and my God. And Father, I thank you. I praise you. I worship you this morning for every person represented here today, every family, every household represented here today, Lord, and even those who will partake. Lord Jesus, let it be a blessing to their bodies, Father, and to their spirit, my Lord and my God, that this day will be changed and things will be different. We cannot say we serve the true and the living God and we are not obedient. We must be obedient, my Lord and my God, for us to partake in your blessings. So, Father, we thank you and we praise you for the opportunity to be able to partake this morning. Praise the name of the living God this morning. I uh, welcome back to worship you as Sister Maria and Sister Sandra distributes the wine and the bread. Praise the Lord. Wonder-working power in His name. We believe. We believe. There is power in the name of Jesus. There